welcome back to another video wait i feel like when i'm standing i'm presenting let's sit down okay let's see if this is better i'm oh, just trying to get comfortable with you hi and welcome to my vlog i'm really happy you're here if you're new my name is kate and i live in new york i make videos about everything i do in new york city sometimes outside of new york if i go traveling and also my apartment We've been at this place for now more than a year and I recently posted an apartment tour so you can go and see what we've done in this place and what we're about to change. Last weekend we changed this rug and this weekend we're about to change our art studio and office into a guest bedroom. So hopefully you come along on this journey. I'm about to go walk our dog and pick up some packages for that room. <laughs> too tall for that. <laughs> yeah, just because it would take longer for this to inflate, we should open it now before we even move anything. Well, I think I gotta move this out of the way first. But we can just put it here now. Wow, look at that. <laughs> the project is supervising you. Yeah. I hope it doesn't just explode out in one way. Yeah. So you and I are watching as the mattress is unwrapped. anywhere on a morning walk and Ben just said that we instead of having coffee because usually we wake up and have coffee and then walk but we're like let's get up earlier and start our day early so we got up and went outside and there's this giant race and Ben is saying that we were supposed to feel good about ourselves for getting up early and being in a park first but of course there are already people actually running and exercising while we're casually strolling Going on another surprise mission for some future plans. I'll update you later. But right now we're walking all the way to Central Park and it's so hot and humid. Another weather forecast from me. Um, but it's a nice day, so. It's always hot and humid now. Hopefully everything works out. Oh, yeah, yeah. favorite building is under construction and there is my other second favorite building thanks a lot project we've been using this room the whole time as our art studio and office but we have some exciting guests coming hopefully this fall so I need to transform it into a guest bedroom. Project is here to help. Project is here to help. 
Um, so yeah, let's do that. The plan is to move these shelves out of the way into that corner and then hopefully build a bed here. Of course, you leave it down the north. And you clean out there and move the desk. Mm -hmm. And I will empty one, move one, empty another one. I'm sure you've already noticed the AC that's running in the background. It was an incredibly hot day, and especially when you're doing this kind of physical activity. So I guess we'll have to do some voiceovers on top because of the AC humming. No, but let's measure maybe all three of them fit there and then you don't have to put it here. Because if you're putting desk all the way to the window, yeah. it will be bumpy here on the shelf. I was trying to figure out how to move the three shelves that we had along the wall where I wanted to put the bed. So we were thinking of moving the desk and then putting the shelves behind it, but they didn't quite fit. Another option was to put one of them to the window next to the desk and then the other two behind it. But again, there was this empty space that I'm not sure what to do with. But yeah, see what I mean? Like it can be all the because it's We decided to move the two that fit behind a desk on this wall and then leave the other one next to the bed. I got this bed on Amazon and I like that it was wooden and also had a lot of space under it in case we want to have extra storage, you know, store those suitcases from our guests and so on. So here's us building it and of course Korzhek is supervising, so helpful. He was trying to get <laughs> some of the papers and like metal parts the whole time, but we put it together pretty quickly. an important decision for me to unpack this box with the frame because we've had it for almost a year and honestly I was kind of annoyed looking at it all the time but also feeling like I don't need to unpack it now and how are we going to move it in the future but it's more important for me that my home feels like home to me that I enjoy being in instead of a storage. We ended up moving the third shelf away from the bed and next to the window, as you can see here, and then we stored the frame kind of over the window, which is an interesting solution. Do you like it? Well, I can't say that I love it, but... No? <laughs> it's conceptual. You can also turn that the other way. Yeah, I can't believe it's been going on now for like two months probably. Yeah, you can 
you see anything blocking my teeth when I'm talking. It's the true thing. Apparently we need an umbrella, so we're getting one. Second attempt. We sleep then. It's so rainy. But it said drizzle. This is like a lot more than drizzle. Yeah. We're back at the Met this morning because the Van Gogh exhibit is ending soon and I wanted to take time to look at some of these paintings again without the crowds. So we went in the morning for the members hours and it was really special to not feel rushed and not stand in a crowd like we did last time. direction that's crazy wow we're back from the museum and it's going to be raining all day so Ben is painting now and I think I'm gonna read I was reading for a while and I actually think I'm gonna make some lunch now and use those quail eggs that you saw me getting last time. I think this already looks so good, but let's make it even better. Here we go. Quail eggs. 
make everything so much cuter, so much nicer, and also nutritious. I think I'll end the vlog here because I think it's already going to be pretty long with the bedroom set up. I think it turned out pretty well. It is, you know, going into it, I was just trying to be practical. I thought we'll just put the bed there and it is what it is until our lease comes up again next year and we'll figure something out then. But we somehow managed to get the bed in there, but also it's still an art studio, there is office space there, a lot of storage including that storage under the bed and I also got a TV in which was kind of a last minute thing I think it will be a nice bonus there for people who are staying in that bedroom We're currently using our hallway table under it so I might order another one probably white and maybe with more storage Let's see if I find something good, I will keep you posted and we'll obviously assemble it together if it comes Thank you for spending this weekend with us. Make sure you subscribe so that we can take you along next time on the future apartment updates and also some hopefully exciting trips coming up. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time.